Hello everyone, Ronix with yet another video and in this video I want to sh show you guys or introduce you guys to my new skin tone lights and these lights are going to be used for skin tone color grading in Photoshop. So I decided to sit down and created these uh, different lots and I want you guys to have a look at them and give me your ideas in the comment section about maybe the pricing and remember this is, go this is going to be like a pack of around 15 lots. So I want you guys to give me feedback about what may be your best LUT uh, in this very pack and what you, you really prefer from this very pack. So it is really going to be affordable, but I would like to see your suggestion in the comment section about how much I should price these LUTs. And before we can go into the pricing, I'll show you guys how first of all Im import or install your LUTs into Photoshop. You know. Initially, when you get into your Photoshop, uh, you have uh, different LUTs. So I'm going to come right here to uh, color lookup right here. So we have, when you come to load, you have these ones uh, basically installed into your Photoshop initially. So these are all you have to work with. So I'll show you guys how, in case in the future I do upload my LUTs for maybe purchase, uh, you'll refer to this video, then you have to import them into Photoshop, the way I'm going to explain to you guys. So, first of all, what you have to do, you're going to first of all close this. Make sure you come right here to Adobe Photoshop and make sure you uh, quit or you close your Photoshop application. So, I'm just going to hit uh, don't save for all this. So, you have to confirm that your Photoshop has been uh, closed completely so what i would like to do you're going to come right here or where your photoshop is so i'm just going to come right to my applications and i know it is the same procedure you have to follow even for a pc i'm going to come to photoshop i use 2020 so in order to install your lights are you going to come right here under presets and you're going to come right here to 3d lights so open that folder. So these are the ones you have in your Photoshop. So what I would love to do, I want first of all create a new folder where I'm going to put these, these ones so that they don't distract me when I'm trying to, or they don't distract you in the future. If at all you're trying to install and use your lights for your daily color grading process. Remember, these are like uh, way too many. So I want first of all eliminate these from my Photoshop. So I'm just going to come right here. And I'm going to create a new folder where I'm going to uh, store these Photoshop uh, actions. So it is going to require of me to put in my password. Yeah, so come and hit OK. So the folder is right here. So I'm going to, uh, first of all, name it like this with a dash or a minus. So I'm just going to put like Photoshop. Sorry, I'm going to use lowercase yeah photoshop like that let's so i'm going to put all this uh, into this folder so i'm going to hit command i'm going to deselect this i'm going to uh, move them into this folder so as you can see i'll put them into that folder then I'm going to come right here and I'm going to delete them from this side because I don't want them to distract me when I'm trying to I uh, use the ones I may have gotten from uh, Ronix photography. So I'm just going to move to trash like that. It is going to require for my password, of course. Then I'm going to hit enter and they will be deleted. So if at all in future you want to install the LUTs you have purchased from uh, me, uh, I put my LUTs, I know my desktop is kind of messy, so you shouldn't even m mind about that. So I'm just going to come right here. Then I created these LUTs and I stored them right here. So I'm just going to come and I'm going to drag my whole folder into the 3D LUTs. So after doing so, I'm going to authenticate and it's going to require of my password still. I'm going to put it and they're going to be moved into 
this large folder so uh, we're just going to open our photoshop right now so we're just going to come to applications and open the photoshop to see if at all it has uh, installed the LUTs for us into or if at all it has integrated the LUTs into its system so this is my photoshop right now so i would like to uh, first of all import some images into my photoshop before doing anything so i'm just going to minimize that i'm going to come right to my folder or my youtube folder and i'm going to select these three images that we are going to be using as a sample for these lights so i'm just going to drag them into our photoshop right here so after they have been opened so these are the images we want to try and see how they're going to affect or how they're going to be affected by the lights you're going to come right here and come to color lookup then you're going to come to load 3d LUTs. so you can see uh, the LUTs are basically right here on top the ones uh, by Ronix photography so you can as well uh, let's see how they're going to affect your images basically so let's see the alpha one and what it's going to uh, do to the image so you can see this specific light uh, is really beautiful because it tends to get rid of uh, the red or the reds in the image and add some kind of uh, greens within the skin tones while muting down the red colors in the image and the image we are using is uh, from encourage photography so let's see a second alpha 2 you can see this is more of alpha 1 but uh, basically the lights are really are going to help you color grade so this is like a beginner step for color grading so that you can adjust it later on to your preference so this is not basically going to be a hundred percent assurance that you're going to get like the right skin tone so you can see if at all you feel like this is too much just come the opacity and reduce on the effect so you can see the before and after so let's, let's try and see three so i'm going to move this to 100 percent so that you guys can see the effect so that is three so let's see we are going to check four and see so that's the four you can see the difference and uh the impact is uh, creating onto the image so that's five so alpha five so you can just come and reduce the opacity uh to the one of your liking so i want to show you guys basically like an overview of everything so this kind of adds some kind of magentas and some cool tones within the highlights so so that is alpha six you can see the before and after so basically that is what it does so let's see seven so this is cooler than six so depending on what you're going in for you can as well uh, knock down the opacity and see if at all it is working uh, well for you so let's uh, see the eight so nine you can see the nine is really kind of warm warmer than eight let's see ten uh, we have 11 right there you can see 11 is really beautiful because it is muting and blending the colors quite well and add some kind of magentas uh, in the shadows let's see the alpha 12 uh, 13 13 is really beautiful and uh, we have 15 so these are the lights uh, you guys are going to be getting from uh, my color grading or my pack for the lats so they are basically like uh, 14 lats yeah they are 14 so this is what you're going to be getting if i told you do purchase this in future and i'm really uh, working hard to get everything in line so that you guys can be able to access this maybe on selfie because it is really a lengthy process for me uh, because uh, even PayPal to work in Uganda is really really hard so I really have to get at uh, the best way to create a PayPal account because the, all the payment things are really complicated and if at all you can advise me on how to 
do that and avail these to you guys uh, within uh, the next seven days i'll be grateful so you can see these are a lot so you can see a before and after they are really beautiful and amazing and you can see how the image is really looking different and uh, it has gotten rid of the magentas in the skin tones remember uh, the magentas are really uh, impactful uh, with the skin tone so let's see if at all uh, we have a different image to work with so this is more of uh, a lighter skinned model than uh, the previous one right here you can see so this is uh, a lighter or a model with a lighter skin complexion so let's see if at all uh, these lights are going to be really useful to people of different skin complexions so we are going to come and we check uh, color lookup like that then you're going to see what it is going to do so let's see alpha one wow this is beautiful because it has really muted all the, those saturated colors in the image so let's see if at all we turn down the opacity and we see the before and the after you can see let's see what alpha 2 is going to have in store for us so let's just increase on the opacity that is alpha 2 it is really beautiful so let's see the 3 and uh, maybe reduce on the opacity and see the before and the after uh, these are really beautiful because it is uh, eliminating all those saturated colors and it is harmonizing everything to give you like that more professional kind of look so let's look at four and see the before and after so you can as well reduce on the opacity uh, to the one of your liking so that's the five let me just increase on the opacity uh, let's look at six I love six because uh, it is really cooling down uh, the image so let's say before and after so basically these are going to be working for your images because I've really tried to embed everything for those who shoot cool tones and those who shoot really warm tones these are going to be uh, working on your images really quite well so let's see the alpha 8 so I'm just randomly sampling so alpha 8 is going to uh, cool down the image like so so much and give you like those uh, blue tones in the highlights and you can as well uh, reduce on the opacity so as uh, before and after you can see uh, these are really looking uh, nice and beautiful so let's see uh, maybe for a melanin kind of model if at all these are going to give us the same amazing results uh, onto the image so let's go with this image and we see if at all they are going to uh, work for this very image so let's come right here and we uh, go to color lookup and you are going to come right here to alpha one and we see what it has in store for us wow these are even working uh, for uh, dark skinned or melanin kind of models you can see the before and the after wow this looks beautiful so you can just come and reduce on the opacity if at all that is not your test so let's see I'm just going to randomly sample that is alpha 4 uh, let's see alpha 9 so alpha 9 is basically adding kind of magentas into the midtones of the image then let's see alpha 12 so that's the before and after uh, let's see alpha 15 yeah this is basically adding some kind of warm tones into the midtones and some kind of magentas into the shadows and uh, let's uh, try and check out maybe alpha 5 onto this image so that's the before and after before after so basically as you have seen these are really going to work for each and every kind of image that you're going to be working with with the color grading and it consists of 14 skin tone lights and if at all you want to advise more on the best way to maybe 
sell them to you guys you can let me know in the comment section because i'm really having issues with the payout or payment issues because i was trying to put this onto selfie and they needed paypal and paypal is really uh really a pain in uganda and uh, they also needed stripe and remember stripe it needs you to be maybe an american citizen in order to use it so if at all you have any other method i could use or any other website i could use to sell these lots to you guys you can let me know in the comment section and i'll be waiting and you can let me know about the best lot and what skin complexion you think works best with these lots uh before i can uh, reach them on to you guys to access them yeah i'm ronix from ronix photography i know it has been a while and I was really trying to create these lights for you guys. So I hope everything goes in line so that you guys can be able to access this in the next seven days.